Ko awa tere te awa, ko whitu matarau te maunga, ko heneru pe te marae. Ko Ngāti Parau te iwi, ko Hana Parau ni Fox Rawa, ko Rawari Paratini o ku mātua. He mihi hōnō re ki te hunga mate, ki a koe hoki e te rangatira ko Parekura. He mihi aroha ki te haukainga, e āwhi ana i tōku tūranga waiwai. Nō reira, tēnā koutou, tēnā koutou, tēnā tātou katoa. I'm Marama Davidson and I've always stood for the care of Papatua Nuku and for the well-being of our people. I'm running for the Green Party in the Ikaroa Rafati by-election on 29 June. I was born in the 1970s to my mum who is from Te Araroa and Rangitukia in Ngāti Parau and to my dad who is from Te Taitokirau. They were members of Ngā Tamatoa and met on the steps of Parliament. They were fighting for the government to support Te Reo Māori and I think I may have inherited some of their activist genes. For many years I've worked with whānau in the community, especially rangatahi and young parents, and worked for 10 years at the Human Rights Commission. I focused on racism, worker rights and as an advocate for whānau. So I understand some of the struggles our whānau are facing day to day. I've lived in Ruatoria and I know firsthand the challenges of trying to be a young Māori mother, living in a rural community and trying to care for my whānau and the environment. If I win this by-election, I will support the movers and shakers for local action all over the Rohe. And I will ensure that the voices of Ikaro Rāwhiti whānau and hapū are clearly heard in Parliament. The health of our people, employment and our economy depend entirely on our environment. Agricultural exports rely on safe, natural food from healthy soil and clean rivers. Our tourism industry relies on our pristine natural settings. We need to support innovation from industries to help us grow jobs that pay a living wage. We could lead the global knowledge economy without destroying Papatuanuki. Ikaro Rāwhiti is a place of abundance in food production, creativity and natural resources. This should be the best place in the world to grow up, but for 20,000 tamariki, this isn't the case. Green policies would mean that every whānau feel empowered to feed their kids, get them to the doctor and keep them warm at night. The Greens will extend working for families payment to every child who needs it, put a public health nurse in every decile one to three primary and intermediate school, establish a warrant of fitness scheme to ensure all rental properties are safe, dry and warm, increase funding for kaupapa Māori education providers and te reo Māori available in all public schools, and enable rent to buy for state housing tenants who want to own their own home. If we care for Papa Tuanuku, she will care for us. But the way we are using our natural resources is threatening her ability to provide for our future mokopuna. Both National and Labour have encouraged large-scale oil and gas exploration, including fracking and risky deep-sea oil drilling. I will fight for hapū having the right to stop petroleum exploration and production happening in their rohe. I will fight for the Māori and the clean-up of every moana and awa in Ikaro Rāwhiti. I will fight for a complete ban on risky deep sea oil drilling. The world is changing. You can choose more of the same from the other parties, or you can vote for exciting new ideas that rejuvenate Papatuanuku and Afiao Fano. I'm always keen to hear more from our whānau and our groups around Ikaro Rāwhiti. Contact us if you'd like me to visit or if you'd like to help out with my campaign. I'm on Facebook, Twitter and the Green Party website. Thank you so much for your time. Kia kaha Ikaro Rāwhiti, he mihi mahana kia koutou, nō reira tēnā koutou, tēnā koutou, kia ora tātou katoa.